The 20 minute whole blood clotting test also known as Weiner's clot observation test is an older bedside test used to assess coagulation status. It is particularly useful for the diagnosis of disseminated intravascular coagulation when laboratory facilities are limited or delayed. Historically, Henry Vorvabeo, a Russian hematologist, cited the spontaneous blood clotting in the syringe or tube as a clinical indicator of hyperacute DIC and hypofibrinogenemia. This highlights the enduring relevance of observation-based assessment in critical coagulation disturbances. The test involves collecting 3 to 5 ml of fresh venous blood into clean, dry glass test tube without any anticoagulant and observing the onset and quantity of clot formation at room temperature. Typically, a firm clot forms within 5 to 8 minutes, followed by progressive retraction and serum separation within 20 minutes. The end point which suggests complete coagulation is when you can tilt the test tube upside down without any blood flowing by the side of the test tube. In DIC or in conditions with critically low fibrinogen, the clot forms late or is weak or friable. It fails to retract and serum separation is poor or absent. Interpretation of the test is as follows. Rapid firm clot formation and retraction indicates preserved fibrinogen and normal coagulation status. Delayed weak or absent clot along with absence of retraction suggests hypofibrinogenemia as seen in acute DIC and warrants urgent intervention. Abnormal clot is one where there is no retraction, serum remains mixed or cloudy, or the clot may disintegrate. Using this test, approximate fibrinogen estimation can be done. A firm clot within 5 minutes indicates normal or mildly reduced fibrinogen, that is a level greater than 150 mg per deciliter. A soft friable clot after 10 to 15 minutes suggests moderate hypofibrinogenemia, that is a level less than 100 mg per deciliter. No clot formation after 15 to 20 minutes indicates severe deficiency, that is a level less than 50 mg per deciliter, that is frank DIC. An extension of this test is employed for the diagnosis of the fibrinolytic stage of disseminated intravascular coagulation. For this purpose, collect 3 to 5 ml of normal patient's blood in a test tube. Allow it to clot. Subsequently, take another test tube and draw 2-5 to five ml of blood from the patient suspected of suffering from fibrinolysis. Pour this blood into the test tube containing the clotted blood and observe for 15-20 to 20 minutes. If the clot dissolves, it indicates the presence of fibrin degradation products in the patient's blood signifying the fibrinolytic stage of the IC.